Right, this week we're going to talk about uh, Sword of the Week. I used to do Edge Weapon of the Week. I haven't done any um, anything like that for quite some time. So because of um, COVID and all the rest of it, it's been a while, but I picked up a collection of really nice swords. And this, this sword has been in a collection for 50 years. I've owned it for five years. It's a Sudanese Cascara, and it was uh, Optimum period, which is late 19th um, century, which is, you know, it was used... It was, you know, very similar to the one, I don't know if it was used in the Battle of Obdaman, but in 1898 there was a battle. Um, it's quite a famous battle between the British and the Sudanese army, and a Churchill was in the 21st Lancers in the final charge of that battle. So um, it's it's quite cool, you know, it's got a, um, a nicer sort of blade on it, a little bit of pitting, it shows its age, but it's overall not too bad condition. Um, you, you grip on it. Your grip that's missing the top of the um, the top of the pommel. Uh, I'm not sure if it even had one, but uh, there must be something wrapped around here. Mind you, it's seen service, mate. It's been it's been to um, it's been to a few battles. I, I would guess with it, but uh, overall, it's a nice straight blade. Hasn't got any curves that I you know major curves or twinks or anything that I can see in it, and it's sort of copied off the British Crusaders sword. As, as got a cross sort of thing, so um, the Sudanese used to copy that sort of sword, so it's quite a nice sword. Uh, we're just going to show the um, Narnia movie that it was in. Um, this was, it was hired out by the, the collector that had it for 50 years, and it was hired out in 2005, and, it, and he had a suit of armour at Trafalgar House in Only Hunger, which is a big mansion up there in Only Hunger, and um, he, he had it sitting in the hallway, and it was, the house I think was about 140 years old, and I think they're pulling it down today. So he had it in the hallway with a suit of armour. The suit of armour was sold about five, ten years ago, and this was with the suit of armour, you know, down his grand hallway down there. So, um, you know, it's got a little bit of flex in the blade, but we're going we're gonna, to, oh, there's a couple of dolls. I'm selling these dolls or army men, like sort of action man figures on um, Trade Me, so I'll put those over the next, um, I've, got, I've got one of them listed at the moment, which is this dude. I'll probably list another a couple of them this week, and then we'll list a couple more the next week, but I'm going to keep a couple of them, because I think he's quite cool, might keep one of these SS dudes, or maybe about three, but I don't need all these, and I've bought these sort of all together, or off two guys, and I thought they were quite cool, I, I, you know, some of them come with original cardboard boxes, but stupid old me goes and throws the boxes in the rubbish bin, yeah, so anyway, so um, I'm just going to sell them as, as they are here, yeah, so... Yeah, rather cool. So we're going to just see the cricket scene from the Narnia movie, so you can sort of see that it was in there. So it gives a, you know, it's just something a bit different with the sword, and it should stay with it. So this is the uh, take from the Narnia movie. Are you ready? Are you? So a lot of people would have seen this movie, or, you know, with, with their kids or whatever. Go through the window. There we go, we see the suit of armour there, and there's the sword just on the ground there. So the sword's lying right next door to it. Yeah, so they hired this for about 10 weeks. So anyway, that's that's the sword, and um, that's what we're all about. So if you like these videos, once again, uh, we'll do, you know, I'm going to list this one the following, the following week. Yeah, I'm going to list this one the following week. Sorry, TV's gone on, but that's just the breaks. Um, we're going to list this the, the following week. Um, this is a, a US sword, and it's got a little whistle. Not that I can blow it very well, but, you know, I smoke. Thank you.